In every society, in every culture, there is the practice of magic or the understanding of the supernatural. Magic is a universal language. In the Department of African Studies, one curator has made an exciting discovery. It's a text written in Giez, an ancient language of Ethiopia. If you wish to turn into a lion or transform yourself into a lion, read the above prayer and write it on a silk cloth and tie it around your head. Or if you wish to be a serpent, write this and tie it on your wrist. This is a prayer for transformation or to, ch to, to, you know, to change into something else. So if I do try this prayer and I do turn into a lion, I don't have the counter prayer to turn back into a human. So for that reason, I wouldn't read it. Yes, I wouldn't read it, no. It's, uh, it's readable, it's straightforward, but yeah. This spell was found smuggled within the pages of a mysterious book. It's from Gonda in Ethiopia. Understanding this manuscript is trying to sort of understand the history of magic from an African perspective. So the owner of this manuscript would have been a Dabtara, the equivalent of an alchemist. And this particular manuscript would have been kept a secret. By the 15th century, this type of magic had been outlawed by Ethiopia's Christian king. So manuscripts like these are exceptionally rare. But despite its Ethiopian roots, this branch of magic is very similar to an important subject taught at Hogwarts. This book is defense against the dark arts. So the purpose of this talisman is to protect the client from real or imagined harm. 